There are many people out there who say that the rapture happens before the mark of the beast comes out. But I say, according to Revelation chapter 14, starting in verse 6, the next major event in history is going to be the sixth seal of Revelation, which is Babylon the Great Falls, and it is a nuclear attack, a worldwide nuclear strike. So here's the point of this video is, you'll know that what I'm saying is true when it happens. Now, if the rapture happens first, then what I'm saying is false, and we'll all be taken out before any of this stuff happens. But if what the Bible says is true, and if Revelation chapter 14 is God's word, then according to that, the next event is Babylon the Great Falls, which is the sixth seal of Revelation chapter 6 verse 12. It is a nuclear attack, and it is also the day of the Lord, the day that the sky is turned to darkness and the moon to blood. Late figs fall from the sky, and all men, great and small, rich and poor, leaders, kings of the earth, the generals and military leaders will be hiding in the dens of the rocks and in the caves, just like it says in Revelation chapter 6, I believe it's verse 13, 14, or 15, somewhere in there. That is what, Now, when that happens, that is the sixth seal, which means that the first, second, and third seal have already been pulled. And if you watch my other videos where I talk about the history of the earth since 1492, you can learn what the first seal was. The second seal was World War I. Okay, historical fact proves that there was time of peace, world peace, just before World War I. And just before that, we had the time of imperialism, which is all consistent. Right after World War I, we had the Great Depression. That's the third seal. So everything lines up, okay? But for those of you who have this fantasy, this fairy tale, this, you know, Wizard of Oz you know, clicking your heels together, saying there's no place like home, and imagining good thoughts, and then you're going to say that the rapture happens and North American Christians are never going to have to go through any kind of trial, unlike any of the Christians anywhere in the world throughout history. You look at the Christians in North Korea, China, in the Middle East, and all over the world, they're all persecuted. You look at the Christians throughout history, all the different great persecutions. Box, Fox's Book of Martyrs is like that thick. And yet the Christians in North America insist that God, basically they're trying to force God, God, you have to rapture us out. But God says, no, I'm going to leave you there to prove that who has genuine faith and who does not. And the Bible says that those who are lukewarm, you who are lukewarm are going to vomit you up. And the Bible says that the disobedient and those who do not serve God faithfully, the Bible declares that when persecution comes, they quickly fall away. And the Bible says that the, our gathering to the Lord in 2 Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 1, 2, and 3, it says our gathering to the Lord and the day of Christ will not come until first there be a great falling away and the man of sin is revealed. I proclaim that after Babylon the Great falls, the mark of the beast will come out, and then there will be a great falling away, and when that happens, everyone will know for sure that is the man of sin. That is the Antichrist. There will, it will be revealed without any type of speculation. So here's what I'm saying. When the next event, major event, is Babylon the Great falls, then you'll know that Everything that I'm teaching is right, and everything that they teach when they said the rapture happens first, you'll know that they're all wrong. The point I'm trying to make is this. The, the proof that what I'm saying is true is when it all happens exactly as the Bible says, detailed in Revelation chapter 14, starting in verse 6, all the way down to chapter, or to, all the way down to verse 20. And then it actually, the timeline continues all the way through chapter 16. So, in conclusion, 
according to the Bible, the rapture does not happen first. The mark... For the next thing to happen will ba Babylon the Great Falls, then the Mark of the Beast comes out, then great persecution, great falling away, and after that, the harvest of the earth or the rapture.